Hello folks, thanks for joining us again on the Hoppy Hippy Homebrew channel. We've got a taster for you this evening and it's from a little one again. And uh, it's Luminous Nights. We've, we've done the Luminous Lights on here, which is a single IPA. Well, the Luminous Nights is a double IPA. <clears throat> I can't remember much, it was but 189, 199 a can. There's the can art for you. Typical 71 brewing as well. 71 brewing. Uh, were they in Dundee, I think, aren't they? I can't remember where they are. Luminous Nights is an amped up version of Luminous Lights with extra hops and malt. This New England Deeper provides a big tropical hit both on aroma and taste with low bitterness to showcase the yeast and hops. 7.4 ABV, 440 can, suitable for vegans, uh, Dundee. 71 Brewing Company Dundee. So here we go. Sounds good, let's get it in the belly. I'll show you porn, show you the colour. A slight haze in it there by the looks of it. Quite lively as well. Is that focused on that? No, isn't it? Well, there's a bit of uh, a bit of action right out the can there. <clears throat> so it's certainly got a is a bit of a. Uh, you can just about see through it. Lots of uh, carbonation, as you see by that head. Lots of carbonation coming up there. It's like mostly orange colour. Light orange. Gassy, gassy, gassy. Well, it's got a smell. Oh, no, 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 no. It's orangey zest, definitely. You've not got the right light on you. Your end, that's a bit of representation of what it is there. You bit lighter than that. You can see it's just clear at the bottom there. I just got a slight haze through the lot. You can just see my fingers through it. So, quite a nice looking drink. And lots of carbonation in there. Very zesty indeed. What did it say? It's like lemon. You know that soap you used to get? Zest, was it? I can do an amped up version of Luminous Nights with extra hops and malt. New thing. Uh, both had a big hit and aroma. <laughs> Can't wait to taste that stuff. It's Beautiful smell, beautiful nose. It is tremendous. You've got lemon curd, you've got orange peel, lemon zest, pineapple. I'm getting pineapple now. Pizza. For the pineapple raw oh, pineapple I pineapple is now the prominent. Let's get us in the belly. Bottoms up. Oh. oh it's a tongue tingler. Oh <laughs> Woo. <laughs> that saves me bleeding out later. It's a tongue tingler. It's so. It's. What did it say again? Ramped up. Extra hops provide big tropical hit. 
No shit, Sherlock. Oh, it's going to calm down in the third mouthful there. Whoa! That is a big hitter. I've tasted better eh, citrusy beers, I must say, but the aroma of this thing is amazing. The It's got very nice flavour. Mouth watering. My mouth's running. It's Got the dry mouth feel at the top there. Cold, wet, damp lips. <clears throat> You've got the long lingering pineapple. That is gassy stuff. It's all going now. You've got the lingering pineapple. <clears throat> And a pleasant burp aftertaste as well. Pretty good, this stuff, by the way. And it's a nice body as well. Should it be a bit more heavier for a deeper? Probably not. It's maybe just on the thin side of a deeper, but hey. It's a nice experience, a nice colour, nice experience. It's a bit more bitter than it is sweet. Much bitter. But it's the extra hops, isn't it? I don't know, it didn't say what hops it was, did it? It just says extra hops. Alright, it's that small in these cans now. I can't even read the ingredients. Contains. No, barely reading the looks, that's what it's telling you. Barely reading the looks, is what it's telling you. But there, I tell you what, folks. I like this. 7.4 by volume. Luminous Nights. It's in the Aldi at the moment. You've got the Luminous Lights as a kind of... The, the L version. This is the GL version. Not quite the gear, but it's the it's the GL. You get the headrests and stuff. The rear headrests in this one. Not just your basic... Don't get a radio or anything like that. You get a CD player with that one. And the aroma contains just continues to be as nice as you first uh, had it. So I'm happy with this one, guys. This is Luminous Nights, seventy one Brewing Company. <laughs> Dundee, Scotland. Full forty can. Let's give it a let's give it a review. Or a, a score out of 10. <clears throat> Although I like it, it's not going to be a big number. And I mean from eights upwards. It's not going to be that. I tend to reserve the numbers for really special stuff that makes a real impact on me. And this has done okay. It's just that bit too bitter. It's just that tad too bitter. Therefore, I will give it a score of 6.8. There you go. Just plucked the eight out of the sky there. You see that? You see the brain working? 
get you sell a point number here quickly. People's watching you. 6.8. Relatively, really good score. It's just that bitter and dry. That was the original uh, first three mouthfuls shakes. Because it was like sucking a lemon. But it's nice. I would recommend it. How many of these could you sit out in the garden in the summer and have around a barbecue and a campfire? Before you get really tired of it. I'd probably do four of these in. Maximum. Bit of sediment at the bottom there, floating about. Bit of yeast at the bottom. I'd probably go four before you say... That's enough. Let's go into something a bit more sweeter. So there you go, folks. Thumbs up from me. It's a thumbs up from the Hop Eppy. So thanks for joining us again. Don't forget we've got the, the Facebook group, Hop Eppy Home Brew. Put a request in there and we'll, uh, I'll, uh, if I like you, let you in. So on that note, guys, thanks very much for joining us again and we'll see you in the next video. Cheers. <laughs>